Hello, it's Raining Plum Bobs back with another video. So today I am making a school classroom. Basically, that was the situation. I already said in yesterday's video that I was going to make a like um, school, two back to school type videos. These are them. This is the second one. I have made a classroom very much like this before, except I didn't actually... There just was like a huge airplane that just flew by. Sorry for the pause. Um, I did build a classroom a bit like this before for my uh, machinima, but I didn't make a video about it, so I just decided to like kind of recreate it but change it up a bit. Uh, I do think this classroom is really cute. It's not really like what my classrooms look like, cause my my uh, I know a lot of schools have like those individual desks for like one person where like each person has a little cuticle and there's like some people that sit in the back and some people that sit in the front whereas my school on there's like white balls whiteboards and like and smart boards on all the different sides of the walls so you kind of just wherever you sit you're still visible like to the teacher there's no way that you can like not be available for them to see you but I think that's better because then like the people that misbehave like will get in trouble I guess I don't know <laughs> Um, yeah, but that's basically it. This classroom fits, like, I think, like, maybe 12-ish people, maybe 13 plus the teacher, you know? But, um, I don't really know where I came up with the idea specifically for, like, what it looked like. I, I just, it was just kind of an accumulation of, uh, knowledge and guessing about, like, what different schools look like. Because I could make, like, what a classroom at my school would look like. But that wasn't as much fun, you know? So I was just like, let's do something different. And that is what I did. Um, I think it's really cool, though. I did make sure that, like, each different space... Oh my gosh, I didn't even speed up this video. I'll do that, though. I did make sure that, like, each of the spaces were, like... Each of the desks have, like, a different kind of personality if of the person that, like, sits there. So... Typically, like, just kind of stereotypically, the people that sit in the back are, like, the misbehaving ones. So I put a bunch of, like, the backpack with, like, the cross, the the bones cross. I put that back there and a bunch of, like, mess and clutter because I just feel like, I don't know, that is what happens, I, I'm assuming. But, uh, I don't know, things like that that like, just kind of add more life to the build, per se. I think those, like, just make the build nicer. But, I mean, I do have, like, a short type story. I mean, at school today, they were kind of talking about the whole, like, detention system and, like, how you get, like, write-ups and different things, like, levels of, like, in troubleness. Luckily, I am not one of those people that, like, really get in trouble that much. I'm, like, at school to learn and then, you know, I don't know, go to college and then get a job and then, I don't know, make money or something. <laughs> that's kind of like the basic what everyone does with their life, I feel. But like, that's what I'm trying to do. So like, I'm not trying to misbehave in class because then I'm like, gonna get in trouble and I'm not really about that getting in trouble life, you know? So, I mean, I feel like everyone might get a write-up at one point, but I, I mean, I feel like it happens to everyone at some point in life, like, accidentally kind of, there's one, something like that, but I won't think I'll get enough to get, like, a detention or anything, so hopefully you'll have to wish me luck that I, like, succeed with that whole thing. Oh, but, um, on this wall, I was kind of imagining what, like, one of those, like, really corny teachers that are, like, I'm relatable to students. I feel like they would have a bunch of, like, random educational posters on their wall that, like, kind of aren't like, educational. And so that's what I put there. Because, like, you see that and you're like, it, it looks like science. But I don't necessarily know what it is, you know? So that's kind of what I thought they would have. Just And then I also put a bunch of, like, things that were kind of supposed to be in a museum or something. I kind of put them in a class just because, like, I don't know. I assume this was a history class. And that's why they have, like, statues and boats and things. And I also put, like, a little fishbowl because fishbowls are cool. But anyways, the video is almost over, so if you liked it, press the like button and comment and subscribe and do all the things that I ask you to do at the end of the video because that's a nice thing to do. And I will see y'all tomorrow because I do daily uploads and hopefully I'll keep up with that. So yeah, bye.